guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is a little bit different i thought i would do a vlog it's been a long time since i've done one of these next week's video will be back to normal with a try on clothing haul but yeah i've got some cute stuff coming up this week i'm doing a clay class on friday where you learn how to make your own pottery i thought that would be super cute to vlog and today i'm catching up with shan michaela and kelly they're all flying up from palmy for shannon's wedding dress fitting which is so exciting i've never been to a wedding dress fitting before i feel like it's going to be like the movie like it's at Trish Peng who's a really great designer I've met her before at Ashley Allen's lash place because she gets her lashes done there too and she's putting on a little high tea and stuff for all the girls so that should be really cute and then we have a lunch with our agency Johnson and Laird after that a couple appointments and things like that so I just thought I may as well pick up the camera today and start vlogging also if you're trying to figure out where I live you'll never work it out because I actually drove away from my house not even for that it's because the lawnmower man was there and a my allergies were playing up i'm like so sniffly and b it's probably safer not to vlog right outside my house because 99 percent of you are normal but there's like one percent of people on the internet that are just plain weird but yeah i'll show you guys my outfit and stuff once i get there i just quickly put some waves through my hair these little hoops here are from asos if they still sell them on there i'll link them down below this little blazer is from dotty and it's one of my favorite ones i own because it's so relaxed fit it's like really really non-stiff if that makes sense it's just very comfortable and then this dress here is from a boutique in new plymouth so i don't know the brand or anything but um tonight when i take it off i'll try and make note of it because if i can find it online i'll link it down below you know the drill i'm just gonna head into ponsonby now i probably won't vlog whilst i'm driving because i don't actually have like a car vlogging thing so i'll catch you guys when we get there i'm so excited shan just landed i don't know if michaela and kelly are on a separate flight but yeah hopefully i get to see them all super soon Yee! i can't wait also i have this top to return to shannon i've literally had it since like bali kind of accidentally stole it off her so <laughs> gonna be returning that This would be the first place these two would gravitate towards. <laughs> really, I'm like, I'm so excited to be. Wait, what? Don't <laughs> yeah, we even made it through the door. So gorgeous in here. Just enjoying some nibbles in our high tea. Look how cute this teacup is. Michaela and I are large enthusiasts. And we're nibbling. And Shan's getting ready. This is so exciting. <laughs> Literally, I'm like. <laughs> I've undone mine. It's okay. I just wanted to show the sparkles. Oh. So we've just come into Brito Mart. We finished up at the wedding fitting. It was so emotional. I can't believe I was such a baby. I know, I was like like cry. Like, like, <laughs> I cried the second they unveiled her. I love her height difference on camera. It's so great. I people think that like it's not that bad, but honestly. <laughs> I am wearing heels today, so it's just not help. Um <laughs> but I don't know, I just wasn't expecting them to elevate her on the little podium and she just looks so beautiful and it was so majestic how they opened the curtains and yeah, this made me happy because I was like, oh my gosh, like my best friend's gonna be in love and so happy. <laughs> it was just too much for me. I swear you and Kayla are way more similar than either of you. <laughs> oh yeah, we were like muttering about everything. We're like, absolutely beautiful. Just gorgeous, like stunning. <laughs> anyway, so we've just parked up. We've got What's happened? Are you scared of pigeons? <laughs> what time in Bali she got chased by a chicken? Yes, I remember. So we're gonna get a snack before we meet with the J and L peeps. Sorry guys, I forgot to vlog. This is where we went for lunch. It was super yummy and it's really cute in here. This is Abby. She's me and Shan's manager. She's the best. Done now. Your little face, I can't. You're just like... <laughs> I had iced chocolate, but I drank it all. Hey guys, I don't even know if it's gonna focus on me, but I'm just crawling in traffic, so I thought I would <laughs> put my camera on the dashboard. Just drop Shannon and Michaela off at the airport. We had such a nice day, honestly. I can't believe how emotional I got seeing Shannon in the dresses. Like, I seriously thought I wouldn't be like that, but just seeing her there on the pedestal thing, and she looked so beautiful, and I was so happy for her. I don't know, it just all hit me. Um, but yeah, I'm heading back home now got leftover curry that I made for dinner and um, I might vlog once I get back because yeah, you can't really see me but yeah 
just chilling. Smell bad. I'm trying a new natural deodorant. It's just like not that good. <laughs> guys have any recommendations for natural deodorant let me know because i'm trying to change from the rexona clinical protection but um nothing works as good as that but like i know aluminium i know aluminium is bad for your armpits okay talk to you soon <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys, it is now the next day. I wanted to show you a couple of things I picked up from the op shop and then tonight we have our clay class which I'm so excited about for Shan's bridal dress fitting thing. The reason I didn't show all the dresses is because I didn't want to spoil the surprise. I thought it was kind of obvious but I might get questions or people being like I wish that you filmed more of the like high tea but yeah it's just kind of her surprise to share so she did put that one dress that I included in my vlog on her Instagram page and that's the style she's definitely not having so I just like pop that in there for fun but I got these two super cute things from the op shop I also bought a mug and a jigsaw puzzle I feel like we're gonna be getting stuck into this this weekend I'm not going out this weekend this is it kittens in the garden it was eight dollars as you can see and usually I wouldn't buy a secondhand puzzle because the thought of making it and there's a piece missing is infuriating to me but this one is in like the wrapping still if we do it before my ski trip I'll also bring it to Queenstown because mum loves puzzles so she can do this one it's not a waskage though those are like the ones she likes but hopefully this would make the cut I'm not sure so I got this little dress here which I'll try on for you and then also this cardigan honestly together they'd be a bit of like a matronly vibe but they're cute separately this is the first dress I got I think it's so cute because it has a little tie on the back so just do it up and it cinches it in so much more at the waist this is the length I'm like right up against the wall to show you yeah so cute and this is the other thing I got this cardigan do you guys want to see something sad though it's got an old lady's name like crossed out <laughs> which most likely means she died this is it on I feel like it's you know kind of boring I mean it's a cardigan but I don't know if I just need a classic cardi and I only really have like coats or jumpers I don't really have cardigans because I just find them very blur to buy like nothing inspiring about them but I liked the little buttons on this and the neckline and stuff sorry for this like athleisure wear under it just pretend I'm wearing jeans and like a normal outfit so yeah I'm really stoked with both of those I feel like they're not super fun prints and stuff but they're just good like wardrobe basics you feel me so one of our flatties is still at work right now but we're all gonna head over to I think it's an Ellerslie the clay class later but yeah I'm just gonna chill for a bit now do some emails like boring work stuff and I will vlog again later when we go to our pottery class I'm so excited these are like in super high demand like I don't know if you guys realize but it's the in thing right now like I had to go onto a mailing list and stuff to get the tickets and wake up early and like they were nearly sold out instantly so it's gonna be super fun I can't wait I might even go on Pinterest and look at like pottery stuff but I'm well aware that your first time doing it it's probably going to look like a five-year-old child made your thing I think you get three balls of clay and then you get to pick one thing to put in the kiln at the end I used to do art classes when I was like tiny like in primary school and we did used to like bake our artwork so yeah I'm actually like super excited for this class it should be good also I used to do those like at home clays like the little rainbow ones and make little characters and stuff and like put them in our oven at home and bake them you can drink as well it's called like wheel and wine I probably won't but I think a couple of the girls are gonna bring like red wine and you can bring your own nibbles and they do tell you to just wear like I think clothes you don't mind getting clay on and that kind of thing so I literally just bought pants and a top from the op shop that I don't care if I get ruined I don't know how dressy people go because I literally bought like a giant oversized men's t-shirt for tonight so I don't really know but I'm very excited it's a two-hour class and everything I can vlog I will yeah it's gonna be so good alrighty I'll talk to you guys soon wow that lighting is immaculate <laughs> this is the vague idea of what it looks like we're here 20 minutes early and um, we're just gonna finish prepping ooh sponge here's the wheel <laughs> this is so exciting I wonder if we like straight all this me too oh you could be on the side oh my gosh <laughs> I'll show you guys the pedal on the side. Look, it's just like driving manual all over again. In those white boxes, please get your two balls Okay, so the next thing is, you got to be, have balls that are going like this, like that, I don't know if it's possible. Okay, let's get the Yours looks great. 
tree. Yours looks more like a tree than mine. Mine's really fat. <laughs> Mine's a dick bowl. Yours is like an almonds bowl. Thank you. Hey, anytime. It's actually a chocolate bowl. Oh, yeah, nice. Clay ball one. He's been transformed. He's my wee little pot. Here's Brit's one. And they're all like a different shape, which is so fun. They're like unique finished result. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. I was gonna make it taller, but I just made a little spiral on the inside by accident, and I'm obsessed with it, so I'm keeping it like that. And here's Brit's bowl, it's gorgeous. Look at that workmanship. Oh my gosh, these are so, of course they would have cool coffee room mugs here. This is my, this was my vision for tonight. Like I wanted to make a really pretty coffee room. I'm just stoked so well, we even get to like pick a color for them. I thought we wouldn't get to. <gasps> That's so cute. Look how big this place is. Oh, hi Katie. <laughs> We're just taking a squeeze at everyone's work. So cute. Hello everyone. <laughs> That was an amazing experience. It is so calming and grounding. I recommend everyone. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I recommend everyone go. Hello. We're just um, vlogging and then we thought we might go and get food. So you go on your way because we might deter and stuff like that. We might be a while. Sounds good. Okay. I'll see you soon. Do you okay. want any food? Bye. Bye. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um. If you ever get the chance, oh, that's better. If you ever get the chance or the opportunity arises that you can go to a clay class, I definitely would take it because take it you too. won't regret it. it and was so fun. You like, never feel. And we've been all period crampy today. Yeah. And oh, crampy. It's actually, no light. I'll turn my torch oh. on. Oh, it was so such a fun flat activity. Yeah. Eh? You don't have to feel like oh I can't do it on my bowls ugly because everyone's looks different. And then they glaze them over with colour, and then I think they're gonna look so pretty. <gasps> yeah, I'll you... insert footage now of the three colours you can pick from because I didn't realise we got to pick like a paint colour for it, which is mm. so cool. So we all got green and white for ours. Yeah, and they're really pretty soft colours. They weren't like so nice, gaudy, no bright blues or anything. Like I feel like I can sleep well tonight. Having my hands in the clay, and they do such a great job of explaining, and they're so yeah, friendly and they're helpful. Really lovely, especially there. if you're in Auckland. I can see why it's so popular that course. Mm. And then what? You can join memberships, can't you? Yeah, to go there. Mm. But um, usually you only get to keep one thing, but you could pay an extra ten dollars to keep both the things that you. <laughs> sorry, both the things that you fired. Like is that the word made? I guess. What do they call, call them? Put them in the kiln. Thrill. So we both paid to get um, both things we made cooked in the oven, just because like I know my mum will want one. And throwed. Throwed, yes. Yeah, you throw them. Also, I have no idea where I'm going. Yeah, I'm I just me. thought that. <laughs> Are we going to end up back on the motorway? Um, keep going. Woo! Did we come through lines? Oh, I've probably gone way past. Like, I'm just uh, driving in the lines. So. Uh, oh, no, 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 you are going right. Yep, yep, yep keep going, stop. But Keep going down there. But do you want to like get food somewhere in town or I could just do a wee Mackey's drive through? All I'm hungry for because I saw those girls was their feta and chips. Well if we see I feel snack. What way are we? Okay. We're gonna get snackies, but it was such a good night. I guess I might end the vlog here actually. So um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> Super, goodbye. <laughs> the stunning lighting. <laughs> And I just had to vlog tonight because I knew it would be a great time and it was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry I couldn't vlog myself making the clay. Unfortunately, there was just nowhere to put my camera. I should have just gone full like YouTuber mode and but bought my tripod. And your hands are mucky. Yeah, but if I bought my tripod, but like, yeah, I couldn't show. And it was all it, flinging everywhere yeah. and you've got <laughs> water juice everywhere. and things. But so. hopefully you got the gist of it and I'll have to show you in another vlog when we go pick up our finished project. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me a comment. <laughs> And I'll talk to you again very soon. TTFN. Bye!